Hello guys and welcome. Are you ready for this list I am about to throw at you? If not, then get ready because this list is on the best weapons and creative destruction. Disclaimer, I'm going to tell you about the best weapon from each class. That being pistol, shotgun, submachine gun, assault rifle, sniper, and of course, special. Now sit back and relax and let's get things started. For the best pistol we have the P357. Although a close quarter weapon and not much ammo per clip, it definitely packs power and with that power, you can easily overcome your foes. Choosing the best pistol was an awfully hard task due to the fact that all the pistols have their downsides in such a big and spacious area. Though for most close quarter combat, I would definitely go with this revolver due to its high power. The best shotgun award has to go to the SAT-97. This super deadly shotgun can easily one-shot your enemies. You're basically bound to win the match with this Hellhound. Though the DTR is also a very good shotgun, when put against the AT-97, there's a small but meaningful gap overall. They are both good shotguns though, but the oldies power is greater. Now things are starting to get heated. Here we have the UMP9, an awesome submachine gun in whatever game it appears in. Great in Call of Duty and does quite the same here. Probably the best weapon when it comes to mid-range encounters and its rapid fire rate does aid it pretty good. Coming at us with an awesome stat set, including range, as one would say, small but deadly. And while we're at it, let's get into assault rifles. You guys probably already know that the best assault rifle is, and well if you don't, it's the SCAR. The SCAR is an awesome weapon with nearly perfect stats along with the AK-47. Hey look, the AK is better. Well actually, it really isn't. Most encounters you'll come up against will be either mid or long range and the SCAR does the job perfectly fine due to its low recoil. The only thing that throws the AK off the chart is its Pretty much it's just the high recoil and the lower fire rate. You know, the SCAR will remain a legend. Well, let's get into the snipers now. Best sniper, AWP easily. If you're a person who's played games like these for a while now, and if you have a bit more experience, you'll feel better having the AW in your hands. But if you're a newer and less skilled player, then you'll most likely find yourself wielding the PSU-1 due to it being easier to control. And there's those who prefer silence, whom you'll find using the VSS. Don't get me wrong, all of, all of the snipers are good, but the AW gets its job done faster, way faster. And well now for the moment we've all been waiting for, the best special weapon. Some people prefer the grenade launcher, some prefer the bow or even the flamethrower. I'm sorry to all of you who love those weapons, but the RPG is actually the king. The RPG can easily obliterate foes in a split second. I can tell you that from experience. The other day I was playing I found myself wielding a legendary RPG I got from a supply drop. Easily won that match. Probably the easiest match of my life. Just be careful not to shoot in front of you while you're walking or sprinting. Basically don't commit suicide <laughs> while you're uh, holding this weapon because it's pretty dangerous. Same thing with the grenade launcher and well yeah. Anyways guys, I really hope this was a nice and informative video to you all and thanks for tuning in until the end of the video. Tell me what other kind of video you like to see in the comment section. Thank you guys for everything and until next time, goodbye.